it's a hard job, man. It's not easy. It's at all. It comes with so much responsibility. That's why I dropped the ball. That it's like, yeah, so do I. It's draining. I think the groom should always tell the best man what, what he expects. He expects. Mm -hmm. I would say if you're going to write a speech as a best man, make it not the traditional, you know, he's always loved. Make it about experiences. Make it about history. Make it about that person and what you see out of them and why they love this person. And don't do the bad person. joke. Don't be that guy. The bad joke. The guy that starts off with a bad joke. Hello. Do I get everybody's attention? <laughs> this reminds me of the time when Bobby shit on himself. <laughs> That's not even a bad joke. What? What are you That's talking just an about? upsetting story. Yeah, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> just look at you. you remember that, right, Bobby? <laughs> Best man give to the group. Anything but ties. I, whenever I get a tie, I'm like, really? Yeah. I gave, uh, when I was best man, I gave my boy a car key. He opened it up, he's like, you got me a car. I was like, no, it's just, it's just one of my keys. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to see what you would do if you thought it was a car. <laughs> Funniest thing ever. He's That's like, Kev, you got to be kidding me. That's this Mercedes Benz car key. Kev, no, no, no. No, I didn't. <laughs> it's mine. I just wanted to see what you was going to do.